Hi yogis, welcome to my channel. My name is DJ Kim. Today is day 18 of our 100 day yoga challenge. In today's session, we'll focus on building strength in the lower body, upper body, including the core. The session includes dynamic sequence of postures to help you develop your strength. But don't worry about it. There are options for all levels, making a well-rounded practice you can return to anytime you want to work on your strength. So embrace the challenge with me and find what works best for you. Props are not necessary today, so let's begin. I want you to sit in the middle of the mat in a comfortable position, either in kneeling position or just sit in an easy position like this. And then let's work on our shoulders first. As you inhale, rotate it up and exhale down. Squeeze your shoulder blades in in the back. As you inhale up and down. As you inhale up and down. Up and down. We're going to do 10 times, 10 more times. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. Okay. Push your palms to the sides. Finger pointing towards you. And then little circle 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax your shoulders. Take a deep breath in. Breath out through the mouth. Ah. Perfect. One more time. Take a deep breath in. Breath out through the mouth. Ah. Perfect. Okay. Put your palms in front of your heart and pursing. Push the heart. Push, push, push to the belly button. Push, push, 30 times. Ready? Go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Relax. <sighs> Relax. I wanted to come up with a table pose. Hips above your knees, shoulders above your wrist. Perfect. And push your body, shift forward. Grab your mat slightly, gently. Feel your wrist. Back and forth. Move your body, rock your body back and forth, back and forth. Slowly and gently. And circle your body clockwise 10 times. One, two. Push your palms into the mat. Three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, come on to kneeling pose, hips on your heels, relax your wrists. This time we're going to uh, put, put our fingers to the edge of the outer side of the mat. Okay, put your fingers outer edge of the mat and then rock your body left and right, left and right. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Relax into your kneeling pose. Shake your 
wrist, shake your hands. This time, put your fingers pointing towards yourself, so just like this, and then move back and forth, back and forth, slowly and gently, okay? Do not push yourself hard. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, this time ten, Sit on your heels, slowly, gently, and hold for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Lift your hands up, shake your hands. Breathe deeply. Relax your wrists, your shoulders as well. Should be no tension right now. Perfect. Let's move into table pose one more time again. Right hands up next to your temple and inhale and exhale up. Inhale, stay there. Open your chest towards the right side. Exhale, open up a little more further. Inhale, stay there. Exhale, open up a little further. And extend your right arm. As you exhale, thread underneath, and then shoulder down. Reach your left arm forward. Perfect. If you wanted to, wrap it around and grab your right thigh. Perfect. Five, four, three, two, one. Left hands, left hands back, push the mat into the mat and then come up to table pose. Lift your left hands up next to your temple, and as you inhale, stay there. As you exhale, open your chest to the left side. As you inhale, stay there. As you exhale, open up a little further. Inhale, stay there. Exhale a little further. Extend your left arm. As you exhale, thread underneath. Shoulder down, head down. Reach your right arm further. Good. If you want to go further, wrap it around. And grab your left thigh. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Release. Come back to a tabletop pose. And come to a plank pose, stay there, tuck your tailbone in and push shift your forward, little forward. Stay there five seconds, five, engage your core, four, three, two, one. Bring your left, right knees and touch your nose, one, left knees, touch your nose, two, we're going to do ten times, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stay there in plank pose five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring your right knee down and bring your right foot to the outer edge of the mat and bring. Bring the left foot down on the ground and then lift your left arm towards the sky and reach up overhead. Beautiful stretch. Left feet push down into the mat. If you can, lift your right arm and here we go. Three, two, one. Zero, right arm back. This time, bring your right foot back. So step on the outer edge of the right foot and then lift your left arm up. Side plank. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring your left knee to the chest and elbow and touch the left knee. One, five times. Two, 
three, four, one more time, five, perfect. Bring your lefty, left hand into the mat, come into a plank pose, perfect. Bring, this time, bring your left knee down on the mat, fit to the outer edge of the mat, and then open up your chest towards the right side, bring your right hand up, and up overhead, stay there. Good. Push the right foot down into the ground. And then bring your left hand up and parallel, arms parallel to each other. Five, four, three, good. Two, one. Right arm, right palms down. Bring your left foot and step on, stand on outer edge of the left foot. Right foot on, on top, right leg on top of left foot. Bring your right hands up five four three two one bring your right knees to the chest and elbow touch one two three four hips up five perfect hands down into the mat comes into plank position inhale stay in a firm strong plank Exhale, comes down to Chaturanga, and inhale, a forward facing dog, and exhale, downward facing dog. Pedal your knees and stretch your body, and take a deep breath in and out. <sighs> Perfect. And a little bit twist. Hips to the left side, bend your left knee so that you have stretching through the side of the body. And bring, bend your right knee, hips to the right side. Perfect. And stretch the left side of the body. Two more, more times. Left, bend your left knee, hips to the left. Bend your right knee, hips to the right. Here we go. As you inhale, bring... Lift your left leg up and open it up. Bend your knees and bring it back. Hold, three, two, one. Place your feet between your hands and come up to warrior one. Perfect. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna do lift the heel up and down, up and down, 10 times. I know it is hard. As you inhale, Sitting deeply and then lift your heel up and down gently as possible. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold five, four, three, two, one. Down as you exhale, spread your arm to the side and open up, open your hips and. Warrior two, look over the left shoulder. Bring your heels up and down five, 10 times. One, two, three, four, you can do it. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold five, four, three, two, one. Down, bring your hand, left hands up, overhead, right hands behind your back and grab your left thigh. Stretch the little side of the body. Reverse warrior, perfect. Perfect. Five, four, three, two, one. Extend your left leg and grab your left toes if possible. If not, just hands down on the mat. That's fine. And Bring your right arms right next to your left feet and stand on the right edge of your foot and bring your left knee up to the side plank. But if this is difficult, bring your right knees down and open your feet to the outer edge of the bed and then bring your feet up. Just like that. Either way, let's stay there five seconds, okay? Ready? Go. Five, four, 
three, two, one. Perfect. Let it go. Hands down. Comes into a plank position. Inhale, stay in a firm, strong plank position. As you exhale, chaturanga. As you inhale, up dog. As you exhale, downward facing down. Perfect. This time, lift your right leg up. Bend your right leg. Stretch the hamstring, side, lateral muscles too. And as you inhale, step forward and hold. One, two, three. And place your feet between your hands and come up to warrior one. Lift your heels up and ten times. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Down. As you exhale, bring your arms in two. Open your hips up. Open your, turn your feet out. And warrior two. Bring your heels up and down ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Down. As you inhale, bring your right hands up and overhead. Left hands in the back and grab your right thigh. Reverse warrior. Five, four, three, two, one. Extend your right leg and bring right hands, grab the big toe. And left hands towards, bring, lift up your left hands towards the sky. Here we go. And then bring your left hands right next to the right fit. And if you are difficult to side plank, bring your left knees down and open up your feet to the outer edge of the mat. And this. Or if you're strong enough, then stand on outer edge of your left foot. Come into a side plank. Ready? Five seconds. Five, four. Three hips up, three, two, one. Let it go, comes into plank position. Inhale, stay there. Exhale, chaturanga. Or you can change the variation, knees down and up top. And downward facing down. As you inhale, bend your left knee. We're gonna jump and forward, forward, jump. As you exhale, four, four. As you inhale, arms up towards the sky, mountain pose. As you exhale, Tadasana, standing pose. Take a deep breath in and out. Take a deep breath in and out. As you inhale, bring your knees to the chest and interlace your fingers, grab the shin bone. Five, four, three, two, one. Extend your right leg. If it's difficult, then interlace underneath your knees. Stay there. If you can grab the big toe and left hands on the waist, let's do this. Five, four, three, two, one. If you grab the both knees like this, then right hands on the knee, under your knees and open it up and left hands on your waist. Or you can grab the big toe and grab the big toe. Let's do this. Five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring it back to the front and let it go. Five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Bend your left knee slowly and bring your right foot down and back. And prayer pose. Put your hands together at the heart. Five. Sorry. Four, three, two, one. Slowly bend your knees, palms down into the mat, and come to plank position. Stay, inhale, and exhale, chaturanga. 
up dog and exhale downward facing dog. as you inhale we're gonna jump jump exhale four four inhale mountain pose exhale tadasana standing pose this time lift your light left legs up interlace your fingers and grab it for five seconds five four three two one and grab your big toes and extend five you can grab underneath four three two one open to the left side five four three two one bring it in front five let it go five four three two one perfect bend your right knee slowly gently and bring your left leg towards the back and hands in front of your heart here we go five four three two one gently bend your knees put your hands down on the mat and comes to a plank position inhale stay exhale chaturanga inhale off for facing dog hmm. exhale now we're facing dog perfect as you inhale jump exhale four four as you inhale arms up towards the sky as you exhale tadasana standing pose as you inhale open your step wide turn your feet outside and then as you exhale gently sit with your hands on your knees goddess pose slowly move if you want to prefer your hands at the heart that's fine move your hips to the left and to the right fill the hips here we go put your hands that's fine relax your shoulders if you put your hands on and right shoulders forward left shoulders forward right shoulder forward and left shoulder forward and here we go and put your feet a little further and gently bend your right knee extend your left leg and sit if you need hands on the ground and feet goes up here we go and right feet goes out and then sit if you cannot sit stay where you are that's fine perfect slowly walk your hands to the left side right foot goes up left foot outside and slowly sit into Kalandasana. perfect good walk your hands in the middle and then lift your hips up if this is difficult try have try to have a yoga blocks or this is fine definitely fine if this is easier then elbow down if it's difficult stay where you are we're trying to learn how to be upside down or palms on the ground and walk to walk behind your feet or you know on the seat in the same line with your feet and crown your head down stay there five four three two one interlace your fingers and support your behind your head push your elbow into the ground and shift your weight forward and lift your leg slowly if this is difficult stay where you are if you can headstand perfectly headstand do whatever you want up and down up and down or diamond or spread anything you want four or five seconds one two three four five bring your feet slowly down and extend your hand push the palm into the mat walk your hands towards the shoulder edge of the mat and come to table pose and gently move hips back into a child pose you did a, such a good job today. 
bring your hands back along side your body palms facing upwards forehead on the ground just relax into a child pose and take a deep breath in and out Just relax into this moment. Slowly come up to tabletop pose and sit in the middle of the mat. Comes into easy pose with your hands at the heart, palms together. Close your eyes. with your spine upright comfortably. Just be here and now. Just be here and now. Be aware of the body, be aware of the mind. See how the body is doing, especially your breath. See how the mind is doing. Is it calmer than before you practice? Listen to the silence from which we are all from. Be aware of the sensation between your palms as if your palms are touching each other and connected to each other while all connected to each other. Although there are distance, there is a distance between you and I but they are all connected through the space in silence in this eternal presence. Thank you very much for being here today. Have a wonderful day. Carry this positive energy into the rest of your day. Namaste.